Good evening and welcome to Friday Night Prayer. As this Sunday we celebrate Pentecost, 50 days after Easter, uh, I am using the prayers for Pentecost from the uh, Order of St Hilda and St Aidan, um, who are based on Lindisfarne, I think. But this is uh, this is their evening prayer liturgy for Pentecost. You led your people by a cloud. Lead us by your spirit now. You lit your people by a fire. Light us by your spirit now. Spirit of God, the breath of creation is yours. Spirit of God. The groans of the world are yours. Spirit of God, the wonder of communion is yours. And we are filled. And we are filled. May your spirit cover all. O King of the tree of life, the blossoms on the branches are your people, the singing birds are your angels, the whispering breeze is your spirit. O King of the tree of life, may the blossoms bring forth sweetest fruit, may the birds sing out the highest praise, may your spirit cover all with her gentle breath. Come like fire and kindle love in our hearts. Come like wind and breathe life into our frames. Come like water and immerse us in your presence. Come like earth and sustain our being. Holy Spirit, fulfill in us the work begun by Jesus. Invigorate our work, subdue our pride, raise us to wonder. Come Holy Spirit, shower your gifts upon your people, gifts of wisdom and understanding, gifts of healing and practical help. Gifts of speech and heartfelt tears. Gifts of love which bind us together in peace. God whose breath gives energy for struggle. Set us free to grow as the children of God. Open our ears that we may hear the weeping of the world. Open our mouths that we may be a voice for the voiceless. Open our eyes, that we may discern your ways. Open our hearts, that we may bring faith to life. Spirit of God, among the wheels of industry, renew the face of the earth. Among the computers of commerce, renew the face of the earth. Among crime infested neighbourhoods, renew the face of the earth. Among tired and broken families, renew the face of the earth. Among the lonely and the sick, Renew the face of the earth. Among the drugged and disillusioned, renew the face of the earth. Among each of us joined here tonight, renew the face of the earth. As the water in the stream makes its journey to the sea, so may you flow with the Spirit until your life becomes complete. In the name of the Father, 
and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I hope that you're well as you join me here this evening, and I hope that the week that has gone past um, hasn't brought too many complications or unwanted surprises and it's been a week of gentleness and that you've had peace of mind as I've been thinking about Pentecost today I think what has struck me is the multicultural nature of that first Pentecost as people from different um, different backgrounds, religions, um, ethnicities, languages were joined together in that town square and yet through the power of the spirit had a commonality, had an, an understanding of one another, had, um, had a... Um, A, a common understanding of um, of the message that was being put forward and how joined together and united um, the people there were by by the understanding and how um, how useful it would be right now in the world for for people who are unable to communicate effectively between whom there is conflict and unrest for, for us to be able to have a, a common understanding of one another and a, a joining together that might somehow help work through the the unrest and the difficulties. So as as Pentecost looms this weekend and and it is and it should be a joyful celebration of the coming of the Holy Spirit that maybe we can strive to try and find common ground with those people with whom we disagree for whatever reason, whether it's politically or um, or on other fun differences which seem really fundamental. But I think um, as the saying goes that with uh, with another human being we always have far more that joins us and far more that we have in common than than what separates us from one another so my prayer for each of us this weekend and for the coming week coming week is um within the power of the spirit to to find common ground where there is disagreement <laughs> whatever that may be. So I pray that you are okay. I pray that you're well. I pray that you don't feel unsettled or um, if you do, I pray for that peace of mind that we all long for. So please take care of yourselves. I'll be back here next Friday and I pray that you all remain well in the meantime. Good night.